What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Thrift Store Monday. I hope you guys are having a very blessed day like we are. A little bit of rain but not too much. Today we are going to the Barnyard Flea Market I believe for the second time in this channel. I just want to tell you guys something. If you purchase one of my eBay products through YouTube because you saw it through my YouTube channel please leave a comment saying I purchased a product through YouTube. It will make me so much happier. I can actually see the fruits of my labor that I'm putting into the videos. So do that. You don't know how much inspiration that will make me keep going, making more videos for you guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe if you're not and leave a thumbs up. You know, the whole thing. So now, let's jump right in. And as you know, we have our wood cook stove burning for the winter. We aren't wasting any electricity on heat, so it's way better for us. But I just took all my stuff to the car, he bought a fishing rod. Not too bad. Gotta see what L has now on the outside over there too. Bought a couple good stuff so far so we're not going home empty handed at all. Alright guys, we are done for the day. Got a couple good stuff actually. I'm waiting for my dad and Gabriel to come back. But this is back in the car. Got some good stuff for you guys to check out. Really cool stuff. We did not come home empty handed. You just have to wait till the end of the video to find out. This is the whole barnyard flea market. You have one, two, three, four, five barns you could basically say. And you have some outside stuff at the back which you guys probably saw. This is the place we go to every time. We might hit the other flea market. I'm hoping we do so we can check out more stuff for you guys. Make a longer episode and make you guys more happier with the stuff you see. Because I know you guys are also collectors out there who love to purchase stuff too. I'm not the only one. Oh, it's okay. It's not bad. I've only been here once. Mm -hmm. I've never been here before. Yes, you have. You just don't yeah, I have. I've, yeah, I've, I've been, I've been you here You came before. here when we were looking for... disc golf and uh, we're gonna play against Bai and Gabriel. Let's see what we do. Please vote for me so we can win this game right here. A little sneak peek of what we got there. All 
Alright guys, we are back at the house. These are our total purchases that we bought at the Barnyard Flea Market. And there was one more flea market you guys should see that we went to that was actually right next to it. That I haven't been to in a long time that my dad said we can go. So we went and we picked up a couple more stuff there that you, we, I will show you uh, right now. First item, we got this Wright Flyer. It's a model kit to build the Wright Brothers airplane. This is not going to be on sale. It's too cheap right now on eBay. The guy said, you know what, I'll just build it for myself. I like the plane, so I'll build it. This right here, though, this Russian Space Center, will be going for about 12 bucks in my eBay store with about 7 or $8 of shipping because this is actually take a little while to ship. This is what it looks like, and if it doesn't sell, I might end up building this too. So I might have a few times to sell. If not, I'll build it. The sides, both of these are inside the plastic, as you can see here. This is the only hole in there, so everything is complete. Great model right here that I think I picked up. Next, we have this 50th anniversary Racing Champions NASCAR thing. I really like NASCAR. I never had a gold one. She so decided to sell it to me. I bought it. And uh, I thought it was a great find. This will probably go in my eBay store. I really don't know a price yet, but probably anywhere from the range of 5 bucks to $15. That's how much these range buy. I haven't really checked them up yet. But that's probably the range. This will go in 5 to $15 with a dollar or two of shipping. Next, you know, you can never go to the flea market while picking up some baseball or football cards. They sold me these. For three dollars for both of them. I couldn't refuse that. These are filled with cards. I have to check up. These are mostly these are all football cards from probably like uh let me see. Doesn't say the year. But they look pretty vintage around from the eighties and nineties. So I gotta go through them. I might sell them as a package, I might sell them individually. It all depends what uh what can bring me a little more cash. But individually, it's hard to sell them because now you got to find a buyer for that specific card. Altogether, people just want to collect the whole thing. So I might sell them all together for about 10 bucks. If you're going to see it there, it'll probably go like maybe in Facebook Marketplace or even in the flea market there. Then we bought this. Twin Mills. You know I really like Hot Wheel cars. I might have a new series called Randomness. Where I just do random stuff and Hot Wheels Racing might be part of that. But this is a vintage 1969 Hot Wheels Twin Mill. I don't see it focusing there. But if it would, you could see it. I re Twin Mill is like the Hot Wheels icon. It's like Twin Mills and Bone Shaker are like the ones that represent Hot Wheels. So I had to pick this up for two bucks. Probably not going to the eBay store right now, but maybe in the future. And then our last item is this truck someone sold me for a dollar that keeps all the Hot Wheel cars. So uh, I could store them all right here, a bunch of them since I have a lot. But if you want to see a Hot Wheels race in the Fireball Crash set, uh, a uh, what is it called? A tournament style. Subscribe. Leave me a thumbs up. And go in the comments section. Hashtag Fireball. And I will make a series of randomness. And Hot Wheels Racing will be part of that. And a lot of other stuff. Like I got a little uh, prank for my brother. I really want to pull and record to show you guys. Me and my other brother Nathaniel are in it. So uh, you might be hearing me right now. But don't worry about that. And a couple other things. So stay tuned. Smash that subscribe button, like, comment, and turn on notifications so you know when these things are going on my eBay store. And so you guys can know when another video is coming up, which means more fun and hopefully more smiles for you guys. And until next time, this is Josiah signing out.